What's going on YouTube? Today we're back at it with the Jeep. What we're doing today is we are replacing the rear sway bar on the uh, Grand Cherokee and it's a 2003 uh, uh, WJ model. Um, I bought a new ADCO uh, rear sway bar and I'll show you the difference. I've just been uh, taking out these old rusty bolts. I first removed there's two bolts that hold uh, these bushings here on the sway bar and if you remove the bolts off the axle first this will let this swing out of the way so you can access these bolts here so these will be the next ones that I remove and uh, let's get to work doing that comes with uh, all the parts and hardware you're going to need. New brackets. Okay, here's the sway bar I just took off. This is the factory sway bar. And there's the new one. Not even, not even close. Look at the difference. Difference between 9 sixteenths and a one inch sway bar. Quite a difference. As you can see, just how much thicker. I mean, this is so thin here. Much thicker ends. I mean, it's just such a big difference. So, this will really control a lot of that back and forth sway with the uh, Jeep that many of the WJ suffer from. So, let's get this on. Alright, so I was inspecting the uh, two uh, lower control arms and the, the Jeep hasn't been driving uh, very well and uh, what I, it, it's been, when you get on the gas the rear end's been wiggling around so I checked the uh, control arm, the upper control arm, the wishbone that I replaced in a previous video and uh, that seems pretty good, seems like it's in there really well and um, I uh, took these out and the middle center metal uh, collar or whatever that is came right out of the bushing so these have these have failed this is why the rear end is wiggling all over is because these bushings are cracked these came and these I've already ordered I'm waiting for FedEx to deliver but as you can see this top one I mean these things shouldn't be able to do that this one was on the left hand side and this is this one's still good so it looks like this is the bad the bad one although i'm gonna have to replace this bushing too i think this one is yeah this one's failing as well so i have three bushings to replace and i'm gonna press those out okay so we got the track bar on and uh unfortunately i can't seem to get these bushings out because the control arms are round and when I go to press them out they roll all over so I'm gonna need to um, get some U-bolts I think bolt it to the press and then get a big bolt and some large washers to try and drive these out these just fell out so um, we're gonna try that tomorrow so anyway uh, more to more will happen tomorrow, so thanks a lot for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.